Hey, welcome to another episode of What's Up with CE. And as we close this year out, um, I don't know about you, but something that I do around this time of the year is get ready to preload the new year. I'm gonna share with you what you need to be doing. Okay, so um, I don't know how 2019's been for you, but the great thing that you wanna be doing this year is getting ready for the new year. So I call it preload 2019. Something all our clients do um, is in December, we all get together and we have this amazing event called the Deep Live Intensive. And I get people coming from all over the country and December's probably the best one. Clinton joins us, um, because at the end we get some nice finger food, yeah. We get some nice drinks happening. Um, but also we get ready to set up the new year coming on. You don't wanna be doing that in the third week of January. So a couple of tips that I wanna to give to you today. Um, nothing about a business plan, but what I would love for you to do is this, is think about breakdown to breakthrough. If you wanna break through in the next 12 months, you need to actually break down your business and have a look at it step by step of what's been happening inside your business. And we call that market intelligence or business intelligence, right? Um, let's have a look at what's happening in your market. What's the data that's come out in the last 12 months of 2019? You know, what are clearance rates like? What are days on market like? What's the average sale price like? How many sales have occurred, right? Compared to the other years? Because to me, it's like you need to get that data to understand, are you going fishing where the fish are? What was your market share this year? How much do you wanna grow it for the next 12 months? Once you start to break those bits of market intelligence, then I'd love for you to jump into what we call the business intelligence stuff. And the business intelligence is things such as, where have all your market appraisals come from this year? Was it letterbox drops? Was it referrals, past clients? Was it expired listings? Have a look at every appraisal that you went on this year. Where did it actually come from? And then all of a sudden, you're gonna start seeing some gaps in your business of where that you can break through for the next year. I know talking to a lot of my clients this year, um, some of the big breakthroughs for them has been social media. I don't know about you, um, the social metrics that I lo look at, it's not about likes. The social metrics that I focus on is about leads. You see me put a lot of videos out there all the time. I'm not looking at the social metrics about how many people love it. Where I gauge it is how many people have reached out to me each week about being part of the CE community. My question is how many people are reaching out to you each week to join your community in your area? So social media might be a breakthrough for 2019. Sorry, 2020, where are we? <laughs> but here's the thing, I really want you to start breaking down your business, see where all your businesses come from, and start thinking about what's working, what's not working, okay? Then when you start looking at all that, look for the projects that you're gonna focus on for the first 90 days of next year. That's something that we do all the time. Focus on four things and do it 4,000 times. It's not trying to get all the information and trying to do 20 things and you only ever do it like once. This is about getting those projects so you can start building some momentum. And as you start to build momentum, you're gonna accelerate your business. And as you accelerate your business, you're gonna to get to a chance after those 90 days to celebrate. But chunk it down, not the whole year ahead of you, just for the first 90 days of next year. I hope this video has been of use. And hey, here's to a cracking 2020. I'm excited, I hope you are. I think there's so much opportunity about to come onto the market. If you would like to join us at a Deep Live event, reach out to me. Speak to you soon.